have my Bacharach PAGM portable area gas monitor set up here in my office. I've got, uh, got it set for 134A. It just ran a purge cycle. It's at zero parts per million. Here's your charcoal filter, which sucks in the fresh air samples. My tubing is going out here. Uh, I've got the wand on the floor where refrigerant does drop. I've got, uh, I don't know, about five or six feet of tubing on there. And I'm going to take some standard keyboard cleaner right here. And I'm going to, it just sends up being 134A. And I'm going to give it just a really small shot. Let's see how long it takes to find itself. Uh, got up to 15 parts per million and it's reading 11, 10, 9. I actually have a window open here because I, I don't want the concentrations to get up too high. I want to uh, run a second video. But you can see how fast that reacts and basically what it does is it's sucking in the sample through the tube using a pump. So it's an active sample and then it it pulls it into the infrared sensors through a set of filters and it measures it. So let's see, it's still with the window open and stuff blowing around in here. It's still finding some refrigerant on a four, three, four parts per million. Very sensitive. Just to give you an idea how big my office is, it's not you know, super large, but I'll get my keyboard here and then I'll just pour, I'll do a bunch here. So I I cleared it out a little bit. Walk back over to the corner here. There's a cloud of 134A coming from that over to here. It just hasn't gotten there yet, but it's rolling across the floor there. And it's going to go crazy. Oh, it's purging itself. You can tell when the beeps stop, it's purging. But, uh, again, there's my it over there. Oh, now it's going crazy. Look at that. At the floor it's reading 99, 100, but it got up to 120 parts per million there. The key is, 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 your, is your sensor going to be sensitive enough to get it? And a lot of these semiconductor sensors, like the less expensive ones that you see for OSHA purposes, they're really not set up to to go under a hundred parts per million so you could have a pretty big leak and if it fills into the whole atmosphere of the area it's not going to go off so and you can see you now it's just i'm almost at three minutes on this video here and we're still reading it 108 parts per million so that was a pretty good leak and that thing is pretty pretty sensitive so i'm going to stop this and i'm going to count how long it takes for it to uh, actually slow down. I'm not going to change anything in the room. I'm not going to air it out. Let's just see how long it goes. It'd just be too boring to watch. Okay, I lied. I had to uh, I had to put some more air into the room here. It's just the thing's been going off for like five minutes. It's driving me crazy. So I'm putting more air in. But you can see I've been... Uh, Trying to air out the room, I'm still getting a uh, 31 part per million leak.